Hi St John's class, are you ready for a game of slam down? Let's go! T D P G S M mm. O A K B J Qu Remember to put your tongues out. We know so many sounds, don't we? I'm so impressed. Now today, we are going to be really looking at the shh sound. Now I know we have learnt this sound before, but I think it's really important that we go over it again so that we really make sure that we know some of our digraphs, okay? So, I'm going to show you the shh sounds. Can you all get your cameras out? And can you take a picture of the shh sound? Take a picture. Ah, put your camera in your pocket. Well done. Now, I gave you a little clue earlier. This is a special sound because it's a digraph. Who can remind me, what is a digraph? That's right, it's two letters, one sound. Can you say it? Two letters, one sound. Well done. So, whenever you see the S, the S and the, the H, S and the H together, they are best friends. And that means they are holding hands, okay? When they're together, they're holding hands. And when they hold hands, we don't say S. They make a new sound, and that sound is SH. SH. Well done, it's a bit like you're telling somebody to be, somebody to be quiet, isn't it? SH. Fantastic, well done. I have got somebody here that wants to say hello, and I know he misses you. It's Fred! Say hi, Fred! Oh, Fred says he misses you, and he hopes you are doing really good learning at home for your mums and dads. Fred, we're looking at this sound. Mm -hmm. Have you got some words that got that sound in? You have? Oh, brilliant! Are you ready? Ish. Fish. Well done. Sh ed. ed. Shed. Brilliant. What do you keep in your shed? Have you got a shed? I've got a shed at home and I keep my lawn mower in my shed so that I can mow my grass. Next one. Sh op. Sh op. When I go to the shop, I like to buy some apples, some bananas, and a chocolate bar as a treat. But don't, shh, don't tell anyone. <laughs> Fantastic. Right, can you have a go at writing down? You're going to need a piece of paper and a pencil. So pause the video if you need to go and get one. Can you write down the shh sound, please? Remember, it's a slither down the snake. And it's down the horse to his hoof and over his back together. That makes the shh sound. Have you all written the shh sound? Pause the video if you need a little bit more time. Brilliant. Well done. I have got some words here. And we are going to have a go at reading. Let's see if we can blow Fred away with our fantastic reading. Okay. Are you ready? The first one we'll do all together. And then... then after that, we're going to have a go at using Fred in our head. And it's something that's really tricky to do. But the more we practice, the better we'll get, we'll get at it. Okay. So. Sh. O. P. Shop. Well done. Now, when we use Fred in our head, 
we're not going to say the sounds out loud. We're going to say the sounds very quietly in our head and we're going to stamp those sounds into our head, into our brains, okay? And only when I push the card forwards are you going to read that word out loud. Should we give it a go? We'll do it. We'll give it a go with shop because we know shop. So, shop. Well done. Should we have another go? <gasps> do you think they're great, Fred? <gasps> he says you are b r i l i a n t. Oh, that's a really long one, Fred. Brilliant. Brilliant. Are you ready? Let's do it again. Ship. Well done. And I've got one more. Are you ready? Stamp those sounds into your head. Fish. Impressed, give yourself a high five. Well done. One more thing before we go with your paper and pen, can you have a go at writing down the word shed? Shed. There are three sounds in that word shed. Shed. <gasps> Show me your three thread fingers in three, two, one, whoosh, and your stamping finger. My turn. Sh, e, d. Your turn. Sh, e, d. Write it down. So the first sound was sh. I know sh. Sh, e, e. Lift off the top and scoop out the egg. Sh, e, d, d. Round the dinosaur's bottom, up his tall neck, and down to his feet. <gasps> Are you ready? Show me your writing in three, in two, in one. Show me your writing. <gasps> if you've got the shh sound, give yourself a tick. If you've got the eh sound, give yourself a tick. And if you've got the d sound, give yourself a tick. If you haven't, that's absolutely fine. Just write it underneath. Write the word shed. Sh -e -d. As an extra challenge, I want to see if you can write down the word bash. Bash. Have a go at doing that one on your own. I'll see you soon, St John's class. Bye.